So I want to derive a result which is uh, very which is analogous to the result that we already derived in the theory of the, of the consumer for the partial derivative of the expenditure function being equal to the Higgsian demand, right? We applied the envelope theorem to derive this result. We're doing the same thing here. And we, what we want to show is that the derivative of the profit function with respect to price, if we change the price of one, one input or change the price of the output, what will be the impact on the profit? The impact will be none other than the exact amount of output or input being pr produced or um, used up in production. This is what we're trying to show. Now, if you remember the firm's uh, maximization problem here is to maximize profit such that the transformation function is less than or equal to zero, the Lagrangian is PY plus lambda FY. And the partial derivative of the value function with respect to that parameter, the value function being the profit function, is going to be equal and I'm using the word partial derivative because I may be changing the price of only one um, input or output in the vector, in the, price, in the price vector. The impact is none other than the uh, output or input level, yp. Why? Because the, um, this is none other than the partial derivative of the Lagrangian with respect to price. Now the intuition for this is very simple. So if my production plan is to produce tortillas using corn, and I need three units of corn to produce four units of tortillas, and the corn costs a dollar each, the tortillas cost two dollars each when I'm selling them, what's my profit? Profit associated uh, with this particular price level my revenue, I'm selling four units of tortillas, $2 each, it's $8, less $3 on the cost side, I'm making $5. If the price of um, tortillas goes up by a dollar, so it goes to $3, what's the impact on the profit? Well, I'm now making $12, cost is unchanged. So I'm making $9. I have increased my profit by $4, which happens to be the number of tortilla units I'm selling. Same idea on the cost side. If the cost of um, corn is increasing by a dollar, so now it's costing $2. What's the impact on the profit? Still selling $12 worth of tortillas, but now it's costing me six dollars in terms of corn, so I'm only making six dollars. I have a reduction in profit by three dollars, which happens to be the exact number of tortillas that I need to produce, I'm sorry, of corn that I need to produce my tortillas. So the impact on, of a change in price, of a very small change in price on the profit function is none other than the output or input level associated therewith. And again, this relies on the intuition for the envelope theorem being that since this, this production plan Y is, is already a profit-maximizing production plan, the plan itself, the technology being used, the, the production vector is not changing if price is changing because it's, it's the optimal vector. And so a change in price does not have any impact on the actual input or output level.